what are you doing? <laughs> he was like sniffing his hand after scratching his ass. <laughs> hey what's up, Everwalk17 here with episode uh <clears throat> twelve of my Grand Theft Five Let's Play. In the last episode, we did a very lengthy episode of the Traverse since I finished my Yu-Gi-Oh Legacy of the Dual Cell P. Well, I uh, today I I'm gonna do two things. Well, two or three things. One, I'm gonna Frick was that? Oh, I felt my phone freaking rumble. My um phone, my controller. But anyway, I want to change Trevor's hairstyle a little bit because I have a, I saw a really cool image I of someone how someone uh changed his look and I really want to try that out. So technically, I'm kind of copying, but then again, I think that's what this game kind of is. So we're gonna go to the hairstylist, which I have no idea where the nearest one is. Where would she rampage? Yeah, that's the uh, something I did in the one episode that I kind of had to cut because it got. Uh... Oh, yeah, it didn't end up looking that good. <laughs> There's a shirt store or a clothes store. There's a hairstylist. Bit of long drive, but no big deal. <clears throat> I forgot what day it is. It's, it's like the 16th today. I think it's the 16th today. Uh, I don't know. Um... There he is. This is my prey, bitch! You ran him over! That's not citizen's arrest! Come on, bro. Look at your clothes. You're probably richer than I am. Jeez. <laughs> It's kind of sad that a lot of people in this world are too, so poor that they have to resort to stealing. It's kind of a sad thing. The reason why I'm not outside freaking stealing money from people is because, for one thing, I don't want to go to prison. Are you serious? I st it's still there? Are you kidding me? I thought I got it. Wow, what a good freaking start to a episode. Five hundred bucks. Eh. I have a uh, a lot of money, so I'm good. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Again, for you know. Killing you and whatnot. Hello there. He saw the error of his ways. Who says chivalry is dead? I only wish more people were like you today. Jeez, you know what I do. A living. <laughs> um, talking about Trevor, not me. I, I mean, um, anywho. <laughs> Honestly, though, I think in this episode we are going to switch the character from Trevor to Franklin because we haven't played as him in a while. And, you know, I just, I want to keep things, uh, I don't want to be playing as the same character for too long, you know, that kind of thing. 
So after we're done doing my mission of changing Franklin, then we'll do a mission of, or changing uh, Trevor, we'll go to do some missions with Franklin. You must have like a, uh, so many twin sisters in this uh, area. <laughs> Hairstyles. What? Ah, I still can't get it. Uh. Come back anytime. I don't know where to get that haircut. Huh. Weird. Okay, so we'll just do that another time. <laughs> <clears throat> It looks like Franklin, honestly. <laughs> okay, um... Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> so let's move on. <laughs> so we do have a few options, but I do want to go with Franklin, just saying, since we haven't played as him in a... a long time. <laughs> oh god, please tell me he's not in the strip club. Smoke shop. Okay. Interesting. Okay. So I think the only mission. Yeah, Michael. So. Lester, uh, what's up? The jewels have been fenced, and Michael's angry Mexican friend has been compensated for the house, so I'm transferring your cut of the jewel store job. Good work. All right, cool, man. Good working with you. Damn. <laughs> Money. <laughs> So it looks like since Michael's the only mission for Franklin, we'll go back to Trevor, play as him for another episode, because I think all these guys are going to be same place, Michael. So we'll do for Trevor because he has one question mark mission, which is something I really want to do. Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. Oh wow, it's pretty close to uh, Michael's house. Hopefully Trevor doesn't travel. <laughs> travel. Wow, good uh good job me. Anyway, um let's just move on. So I think in the last episode I also talked about their uh Rockstar's plans for Grand Zeto six or so so, so on. You know what I mean. Um I'm wondering if they're gonna have like one playable character or multiple like this thing. They're probably gonna do the multiple thing again. Come on, every freaking little bump, every little bump just moves me or just flips me around like nothing. Uh, anyway, um, I'll stop saying anyway. I'm gonna learn how to stop saying that. I don't need to say it so many freaking times. But back to what I was saying. <laughs> uh,. There's probably going to be more than three playable characters because my thing, my theory is, if they're going to make a map as big as the U.S., they're going to have a, char a main character for each city in the game, like each main city in the game. And I'd say there'll probably be around five or six main cities in the game, like New York, Los Angeles, Chicago. Uh, what else is there? <laughs> wow, I live in the U.S. my whole life, and I have no idea what some of the big cities are. LA, New York, Chicago, Boston, uh, just in general, you know, this is not the right way. Uh, maybe a city in Alaska, a snowy region, you know, that kind of thing. But you guys get the point. Oh, uh, Houston or Austin, Texas, one of the, uh, you know, southern states. 
What about north? What's a, ma a big city in the north? How did you not see me? Come on, dude. I was avoiding you. That car, like, popped in front of... Come on! Are you kidding me? Is this episode gonna be nothing of me yelling? Nothing but me yelling and running into other people's goddamn freaking cars? God. Fucking move out of the way for once, you stupid assholes. Holy crap, I almost got my ass ran over. I've never seen more homeless people in my life. Have a seat. Hey, for once you're not a, uh... That girl who's somehow all over the place. <laughs> That's the one I'm looking for. Clean razor. You are such a pleasure to work for. I could do you all day. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no problem with that, but, uh, sir, I'm not... Um, oh, that's not what you meant. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I forgot which one he went with. I think he went with stubble. You probably get... Well, at least this one makes sense. At least these two make sense. Because I could go back in and you get, like, a long hairstyle. Bye-bye, <laughs> beautiful. Thank you, sir. Here's your money. Your $260 for a close shave and haircut. <laughs> And my haircuts only cost 12 bucks. Kind of, I think. I don't know. I forgot how many they were, how much it was, but I remember that. So there should be a closed door nearby, right? Wow. Oh, okay, so it's just over there. Of course, the only one that can give you a haircut is a gay guy. No, a better haircut is a gay man, but there's no problem with that. Uh, who knows? I'm not saying there's a problem with being gay. I support everything about that stuff. But still, you know, <laughs> it's hard It's hard to um, talk about it without sounding at least a little rude. Then again, people do get away with it. Sorry for anyone who got offended from what I was saying. Seriously, I don't mean any bad stuff. I can tell you have good taste. Seriously, no glasses? <sighs> I mean, I could, but I kind of don't. We have that in multiple colors. Fucking zebra. <laughs> Snake skin? Holy shit, that looks sick! Expensive as hell, but... Alright, I uh, definitely don't want those. your time I gotta go with the uh I think the rattlesnake loafers look the best because they're like black with some white so it kind of looks like the pants are going off them to the why am I not playing the freaking game? Like, seriously, I need to get back to that. I'm sorry. Um, 
All this for one little scene from a show you're probably recognizing now. That's from our exclusive line. Well, that's pretty much all I need. Um, Make sure you come back. Back to mission. So then we can shoot some people up in our awesome new suit. Oh, wrong car, wrong car. <laughs> awesome new suit. I so need a huge I'm trying to look like Walter White right from now. Breaking Bad. Ah, start your piece of shit. Just so you know, I've only seen like the first couple episodes of that show. I'm not really a huge fan of it, but I do like the character of Walter. Or Mr. White, as some people describe him. And it, it kind of works because Trevor is a drug dealer and, uh, you know, kind of paranoid and stuff. The only difference is he doesn't have a family. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna drive behind this stupid truck. <sighs> Things I do for a good video. <laughs> that came out extremely wrong, and I'm not saying that I'll do that kind of stuff, but, uh. Uh, I don't know how to save myself here. I'm not saying I'm. Kind of like selling it. Not. You know what? You guys know what I'm trying to say. I didn't mean it like that. I was trying to say it, say something else, but it came out weird, and I can't speak today. Wonderful. A veritable treasure trove. Oh my God! These That's freaking. A good sock. Oh my God. Just ignore us. Yes, don't mind us. Pretend we're not here. Okay. You're not Jock Cranley, are you? Actor and artist. I love your work! Oh, stunt double! Oh, our favorite show, Mrs. Thornhill! Snap! Watch the birdie! Oh, pretend to throttle me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like you did on that, on that poster you did. Yeah, okay, all well, that would be my pleasure. <laughs> oh. uh, like that, huh? Yeah? Oh. Like that, maybe something oh. like this? Oh. Or like oh. that? Huh? Like that. That's enough, uh, you. you like that? Oh, uh, 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 oh, hey. oh. oh. Thank mm. you. Wow, that's quite a woman oh. there, huh? Oh. We are not worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. I'm, uh, I'm not Jock, uh, what's his name? Cranley. Big star in the 80s. We well, love celebs. That's why we came to Tinseltown. Yeah, before we met you, we were trying to break in to Bruce Spade's house and steal his rubbish. The things these stars throw away. They're not like you or me. M Mrs. Thornhill has the most unbelievable collection of celebrity underwear and bathroom products. Things they actually use themselves. You guys have a great vacation, all right? I gotta go. We could do with some help. All this climbing over walls and rooting through bins, it's such a business. Nigel's got an arthritic knee. What do you, uh, what do you need? Just a few fine wood souvenirs for my museum. Look, 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 look at this map. I mean, a lot of these places have famous people living in them, and some that are just hanging about. Could you bring us some things? I'd be very thankful indeed. Americans are the most wonderful people in the world, aren't they? The best! <laughs> Such fun! <laughs> That's it? Nothing? Huh. Well, we'll be seeing those people later. I recognize this house. No, I don't. Different house. <laughs> okay, you don't swerve like that, bro. 
Our little bunnies almost ran them over. But yeah. bunnies? Wait, what? I don't remember bunnies being in this game. And I guess since it's a, I guess they added a few new animals like rabbits. I think I saw a boar once. Scared the, scared the total crap out of me. Um, I hate the slow motion. <laughs> Landed it. Okay, so this is basically how this, uh, Miss me. these work, these guys work. Those orange dots on the map, that's basically where they're going to be. <laughs> so, looks like the golf club one might be the toughest. So I'm gonna do the small one, the big one, and then we'll do a Michael mission. This episode's gonna be a bit long, just saying. Still Alex Dixon's clothes. Interesting. Did it say Alex? I think his name is Taylor. Gonna get around here. We just climb over the gate. Yep. Come on, get in the hot tub with me. I'm bored. I think that pill you gave me is wearing off. I've been watching you do laps for like two hours now. Okay, babe. Hey! Who the fuck are you? Yo, what do you think you're doing here, man? This is private property. Just pretend I'm not here, kids. <laughs> you're crazy. I'm calling the cops. Alright, so apparently he caught me, so I'm... Hello? Police? Uh... <laughs> Come on! I know you just freaking flew through the air like I don't know how many miles up in the air, but or feet because that's clearly not even close to a mile. Um, <laughs> but it doesn't mean you had to stall. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Just it right here. I should be fine. Oh, unless the cop, for some reason, decides to go down the freaking road, which he is. Hello, this is Nigel. Please be quick, I'm roaming in the United States of America. It's me, in nutcase. I picked up some clothes from your friend Tyler Dixon. There's even a skid mark. What fantastic news! Wait till Mrs. Thornhill hears about this. Oh, she will be pleased as punch. Oh, dear. 
Weed killer. Oh, we're supposed to kill the guy in the. Okay, come on. Camera angle. Camera angle. Thank you. Did that cop try saying pull over? Because if he did, then it sounded like he was just yelling as loud as he can. <laughs> Alright, let's not do any more of those Nigel missions. We'll do plenty of those missions next episode if we don't have any free missions for Franklin. But we've been doing this for episode for a while, so I honestly want to get to the main mission. Every stupid car that I see... I've run into at least once. It's getting annoying by this point. All right. There you are, you little shit. You looking for this? No, very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> Trevor? Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Mm. Yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been uh, resurrected. Ain't this Graham? Yeah, well, I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those fake your own death to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in a big mansion. Awkward situations. It's one way of looking at it. Yeah, do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all long time ago, man. I've been in witness protection. I still am. That's great. That's great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? <laughs> Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. Nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner. But, yeah, uh, can't blame you. Who are you? Namaste. I'm Fabian. <sighs> Good lord. Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, sh she's, uh, she's, uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? She's auditioning for fame or shame. Fame or shame? The fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skill show. She loves it. You guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh, Christ. She's a horrible dancer. Michael. She might disagree with you on that. Jesus Christ. What? Now? Now? Where? Um, the Maze Bank Arena. Oh, little Tracy being humiliated. Let's go. We go get her. We... Yeah, we. What are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go. Come on. Right. It's kind of weird that even you know, though I Trevor's the poorest out of the. Let's say we grab a beer in a few hours, catch up properly. I'm good, homie. She's my daughter. I'll handle it. <laughs> Judging by past behavior and the state of the rest of your family, fuck only knows what that means. Hey, fuck you. Yeah, you're a model husband and a wonderful parent. You can just tell. You walk into my home and try to tell me how to run my life. It don't work like that, amigo. It's nice to see you and all, but you stink like piss, you got blood under your nails, and you look like you've been up for what, a week? Who the fuck are you to tell me anything? I'm someone who knows you, you f 
fucking slippery snake. I know this. Jesus! The second I leave you, you'll just go home. We're gonna get your girl from these assholes. You're not abandoning her like you did me and Brad. Yeah, Brad. Poor mother. Fucker must have woke up handcuffed to a hospital gurney after that stunt of yours. He still writes to me from the joint, you know. Really? Yeah. Okay. So, how you been doing? Oh, I'm getting by. Aside from the loneliness and heartbreak, of course. You live in Los Santos? A few hours away. Okay. So where? Sandy Shores. The Alamo Sea. Ah, I hear it's nice there. I'm making a personal injury claim. Fucking beautiful. I mean, we ain't got the tennis courts, the golf links, all the pumped up plastic sluts you're used to out here, but, well, you know, it'll do. Yeah, well, you know, I'd ask you to stay, but... Yeah, don't worry, all right? I got somewhere to crash while we work things out. With actual friends. We got things to work out. <laughs> yes, sirree. I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah. Even though Trevor's the poorest of the three, he seems to look like the most well-dressed now. <laughs> Which brings me to the all three playable characters. They each have different amounts of income. Michael's the richest, Franklin is middle class, and Trevor is the poorest of the three. If I have to describe myself as one of those three, I would have to say Franklin as middle class. I'm not that rich, my film is not that rich, and not that poor. Just right. This has got to be it. The maze bank. Let's go in. Let's find your baby. You can't park there. Production vehicles only. How did you end up like that? Come on, you dipshit. Ah, that host, man. He's like any closeted TV presenter. Bitter as fucking vinegar. Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir. May I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta. Fuck, screw this. Where the fuck's Laszlo? Auditions, Fame or Shame, Season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. Uh, hi. All right. Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling, and working with children. That's, that's beautiful. You're so original, like oh. a, a basket full of puppies or a <laughs> rainbow or a pile of puke. Oh. Who are these clowns? That's my dad and... Trevor? Two dads. Uh, <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. What are you guys doing here? Yeah, what are you uh, doing here? Okay, I'm back. Relax, chill. Make yourself at home. He's got a little show to do here. Okay. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Music. Take what your daddy's gave you, honey. Mm. Look at that, I was stuff a 20 in this. Oh! You fucking do something about this? Uh, uh, that's enough. Oh! Oh! I said that's enough! Hey! Oh, 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 hey! I got security! Security! What you fucking Hold say? Come on! Big guy. Come Hold on! There. No. Oh. Oh. No. Come here, you little shit! No. Go home right now, Tracy! Come back here! Almost ran into the window. <laughs> All right, we take their truck. Get in the truck, Michael. I got a deposit on that truck. Let's get that brick. 
Ui, nem isso, né? I think there's a, a a uh, achievement for this lot mission, not achievement, but a way to get a gold medal is that you have to do this with the trailer hitch or whatever it's called. Where is he? Found him. I saw him turn left. Be careful. Uh, I'm trying to be careful, but you know, short turns, big truck, momentum. Ah, the little best is going up to the train tracks. Oh shit! A stupid indestructible pole that shouldn't be indestructible, but Bring somehow it is. Fun. Let's not try to kill this brick, all right? When we crush his little toy car, who knows what'll happen to him? I lost him because... Good to know. I knew this city would be full of douchebags. Can we speed it up a little? Huh? Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. Hard to steer when there's cars freaking heading for you every time. They're heat-seeking missiles. They always hit me. Head right up here. Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? Ten fucking minutes in L.A. Shut up. That cocksucker might be famous, but oh. Whenever I get close, there's always. We'll get him. We'll get him. Well, we're sure taking our time about it. That was bullshit. It's going down into the LS River. I can see that. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. I hate him even more in person. He was never funny. Speed up, you stupid freaking truck. Can you be slower than... Can you be... Any slower. All out of juice. Oh, hey, 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 you guys, you run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything by it, all right? Oh yeah. Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would rip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. Look, I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack it in traffic. What's your talent, huh? I mean, aside from love and sex. Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. That's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. Huh. You proved your point. Huh. This is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head. And you! Huh? Hey, that's awesome. Uh, uh, hey. There you go. Uh, uh, All right. What do you do now? I want you to dance sexy, celebrity. Mm -hmm. I mean, I need music or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll, I'll dance. Good. <laughs> All right, now drop it like it's hot, all right? I want to see you get nice and low. Come on, lower, oh, lower, no, come on. No. Oh, please don't kill me, okay? I'm supposed to be on a magazine cover next week. All right, all right. come on, no. get off. Take off, go, now, before I change my mind. I got it all on my camera, you fucking pussy. The world's gonna see your shit. <laughs> I'm going home. How the fuck did you do it without me for nine years, huh? <laughs> Dave, we need to talk. 
I was about to tell you the same thing. Okay. Meet me at Galileo Observatory as soon as you can get there. Okay. Well, I guess we're playing as Michael next? <laughs> Famous shame. Um, anyway, guys, hold on a sec. Yep, told you. All hooked up. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Also, please subscribe for more.